Hey YouTubers, today I'm gonna show you how to change the fore end of uh, an Hawk uh, IAC982 or IAC Hawk 982 12 gauge shotgun. It's a clone of the Remington 870. Okay, why am I changing the fore end on my Hawk uh, 982 shotgun? First of all, um, the forehand looks plain and just boring and it's heavy plus a deal came in my way uh, I bought this on eBay it's a black hawk forehand for the Remington 870 so since this is a clone for the 870 theoretically this should fit this is the black hawk forehand because I've read some reviews that it does not fit the Remington 870 and some people have uh, did some filing before it will fit so let's check it out if it will fit my Hawk 982 shotgun first let's take the shotgun apart this assembly see the chamber is empty Start with this end. I'm still surprised uh, and amazed how easily shotguns disassemble. That's the barrel right there. Metal piece that uh, it feels that it's spring loaded. You just have to press it on the side. It's uh, in front of the magazine tube. Press it on the side and pull the forehead. Okay. You see that? Okay, there you go. It's out. This is how. Uh, simple shotguns break down. This is the base, the forehand, and this is your bolt. Okay, this is a nut. Like I said, you just align this to loosen this when you turn. See? And then slide it out. Okay, let's compare the weight. This is the stock. It's 9.8 ounces, and this is the Blackhawk stock forehand. It's at 7.7 .7 ounces. Uh, let's put the tube inside the Blackhawk. See, it slides in, and it becomes a little tight. Just needs to push it down. Push it some more. See? There you go. That's it. It's inside. And it locks in place. Okay? And then get your nut. And this will lock the tube in place okay and then tighten it with your um, long nose pliers needle nose pliers okay. okay putting it to get putting it back together with the new forehand it's just the opposite of what we did earlier now insert the magazine tube inside the new forehand okay. then get your bolt
make sure that the tabs are aligned with the bolt so that it catches the bolt every time you rack it. Pull it, push it inside until it won't push anymore. And now there are two uh, metal pieces on the side that prevents the bolt and the foreign from coming in. So you have to, you have to push them on the side at the same time. Oops. The, you, when you touch it, it seems that they are spring loaded, so you can push it down. I mean, you can push it on the side. Both of them. It prevents the magazine from entering. And the, it prevents the bolt from entering. And uh, it's tricky. There you go. And then the barrel. Just align the tube. Magazine tube and also the end of the barrel. Okay, and then the last piece of the puzzle. I have a new foreign for your Hawk 982 Rogue Shotgun.